All right, so what we're looking at is this drain line. Um, as soon as Shane took the brick out from under it, a bunch of water ran out, but he said really what you want to do this, is- this is, this is how they had it. They yeah. had it like that. And we have that The water's picture. backing up into the drain and then eventually gonna cause a clog that goes all the way to your ceiling. So you don't want this brick here. That was just somebody did for looks. And... So when we took it out, a bunch of water ran out. Reality, what... you should have it like this. Yep, like that. So that water can just drip out in the mud or the dirt. If you want, what you can do, if you just don't like the eyesore, you can go like this and let the water run out down because the, the slope of the ground here goes this direction. Okay. So we can put it like that so your water runs down. Okay. And then it doesn't even go around the unit. It just keeps moving its way down the house. Plus that'll help you with the foundation of the house because you'll keep it moist. Okay. Automatically. Okay, and so, do you want to talk about the leveling at all? All right, so this unit right here is not level. Very so, not level. So we need to level this unit out, and we can do that with little, they have like supports that they sell that go underneath to raise it up. Because okay. when it's not level, it separates the refrigerant from the oil, and it doesn't kill the unit right away, but over time it'll start to damage the condenser inside, the compressor inside. So. Okay. So we'll just, you need to level that. Okay. And so then, leveling is a must on this. All right, and do you want and to talk the about rewire that? right here? We need this. They try to hide. They didn't. They they took a shortcut instead of extending this wire all the way out to the unit here where they should to keep it from weathering and, and cutting and stuff. They didn't have enough conduit, so they were lazy and they just stopped it right here. The reality should be screwed in down here. And if you can see where I cut the tape away, where the, the screws are right there, that was supposed to be screwed in. You can see that screw in there. That should have been screwed in here. They didn't have enough wire, so they just did a shortcut, covered it up so nobody could tell. Made it look like they were trying to make a nice and neat bit. In reality, they were hiding the fact that it's not screwed into the system. Well, and you tried to take that panel off. And you can't yeah, it. and it also, the way that they have this wire, because it's so short, prevents this panel from coming off. So we need, to check it. yeah, so we need to extend the conduit and the wire, give it more flexibility over here, so we can take this panel off properly without shorting anything out or dropping the panel on the internal components. Okay. 